It is often said that the camera does not lie, but when you consider many of the television programs today, the camera does lie most of the time. A lie by any other word is still a lie, and chroma key is no exception. It can be called chroma key compositing, color keying, color separation overlay, green screen, blue screen, to a name just a few. So what is a chroma key? Chroma key is when part of the visible frame is replaced electronically by another source. Usually the front action is filled against a color screen and placed in front of a pre-prepared background. Of course, when making apple pies, we never try to deceive you. We always travel to the places we show you on screen. Chroma key was first developed in the 1930s to create whites for transitions in films such as Flying Down to Rio 1933, but it was the Thief of Baghdad 1940 that used a proper blue screen to allow the genie to escape from his bottle. It won the Academy Award for Best Special Effects. Chroma key continued to be used in film, but not television. Why? Because television was made in black and white. When American television moved to 525 line colour in the late 1950s, the process was employed. The BBC was first to start broadcasting in colour in 1967 using the 625 line power system and was seen using chroma key for news and drama programmes such as Doctor Who. The process is the same whether it is used for film or video. It is only the colour that changes. Blues are normally used for film and greens for video. These two colours are used because they are furthest away from skin tones. Green is used for video because video cameras are most sensitive to green and the green channel contains least noise. Today, multiple use of chroma key is common. As you see, it is possible for me to walk out from behind the desk and walk around in front of it. So how is this achieved? The background is a photo next to the desk so it can be behind me. Myself, as presenter, filmed against the green screen, but the desk also needs to be in front of me. Last, a tree trunk to hide the hand. When it is put together, it all makes sense. However, with the almost unlimited budget of a major film, you can achieve something like this. Back to the studio.